Hey guys, it's Sharp or Chevy, and welcome to another text track review. Today we're going to be reviewing the unforgettable default edit. Um, very clever name, may I say. And hopefully my voice is louder. I turned up the volume, I believe, uh, for it from, let me see, yeah, from 35 to 75, so it should be louder. And when I was like watching my videos like over to see how my voice was, I, I cringed because the sound was like louder than my voice. So you, it would be like drowned out and you couldn't even tell that I was talking and it was really sad. But yeah, um, I'm going to be reviewing this default edit, which I am a fan of. And here are the project tools. Very nice. Here's an inner pearl bow. So the bow is really nice. I like the bow a lot. And then the fishing rod. You see, like it's black and white. Looks very nice. And the flint steel is just like black. But there's a fire. You don't really like it though. Food gapples. I've not seen yet. But here it is. And then here are the ores. Um, the iron ore is actually unique. I have not seen that before. Uh, I don't think I have. And yeah, I really like these ores. Recently, almost all default is have this type of ores now. And oh, dang. not that I'm complaining though, I really like it. And whoa, the diamond armor looks awesome. Big fan of that. Let's go check out the skies. Oh, they don't look very HD, but they are different from what I'm usually used to. I actually really like it though. Oh, this is daytime? The other sky looks a lot better, like earlier. I thought that was daytime though. <laughs> um, but let's go show off the particles now. And sharpness, and critical with sharpness. I don't really know what it is, but as you know, I don't know. Default looks like GUI. And yeah. <clears throat> so if you guys did enjoy this text track review, please leave a like down below. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.